All right. Hey, Scorpio. Welcome back in. Let's see what messages show up for you. Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. All right. Your general message has been uploaded already for this month. A lot of cards. Your general message has already been uploaded. So let's dive in to your reading, Scorpio, and see what messages come through for you. Right. So we have blinded by friends. Specifically, somebody you're thinking about, you're dealing with, and this person is not talking to you right now, or you are not talking to this person. For some reason, there's no contact or lack of communication. One of the reasons is, okay, blinded by friends, having good time. Interesting. Let's have one more, and then we will start with the reading. There's definitely some influence by friends, family members, loved ones, or known people past affairs unresolved situation multiple such okay compromise okay this is very interesting energy for a lot of you i see the reason why you are in no contact with this person or because of some reason the communication is not happening the main reason is the influence from the outside people right friends family members or people who are important in this situation who are involved in the situation for someone very specific i'm feeling that this person or you one of you is having an unresolved past situation or both of you might be having that there's an unresolved past situation and that third person is in the picture right now okay let's see there's a compromise happening <laughs> For a lot of you, uh, if you're not talking to this person, this person might be compromising with somebody else. Or vice versa, right? Other way around. Let's see, see which side resonates with you, right? Scorpio, let's dive into your reading and see what messages show up here. Wow. Queen of Pentacles in the reverse position. For a lot of you, Scorpio, I'm picking up that you felt really unstable in this situation. For a lot of you, this can be your financial situation also, which was unstable at that time. But I, I see that you felt very unstable in this connection. The time you were dealing with this person. Oh my God. And yes, there is a third party situation. Of course, um, if this is your energy, this person is having some air sign in their surroundings. Or there is a female who is very rude, very rigid. Um, whosoever is the person who stopped talking the fe there's a female involved so it doesn't matter even if you're a male your person is getting influenced by some female figure in uh, their surroundings right i see very rigid very cold and uh, somebody is uh... okay this can be an ex of course one of one of their exes right i just felt that let's see what else? Lovers. Yes, you have choices. For a lot of you, you might be coming to this point, Scorpio, where you're feeling that, okay, maybe I should settle with somebody else or I should settle for something else. There are decisions heading your way in the upcoming days. Whereas uh, this person, I see even this person is in the compromise situation, right? They are dealing with multiple situations. We're going to clarify a lot of cards, of course. But this person is in a compromise situation, right? You are feeling very, very insecure in this in this connection right now. Or maybe in the past when you were dealing with this person. Uh, there was some sort of insecurity. There was a... The, for some reason, I see... I'm thinking of financial insecurity also. For some reason, you were not able to feel financially secure in this connection. And for the rest of you, this can be a situation where you were not able to uh, feel secure in this connection with this person, right? Uh, and you were trying to hold back your feelings. You were not expressing your emotions, Scorpio. Again, specifically Scorpio Moon people. Very Scorpio thing, isn't it? Very Scorpio thing. Okay nine of cups fulfillment this person is looking for in for some sort of fulfillment with you of course you are the happiness i do see that eight of pentacles bottom of the deck i am also picking up that two of cups yes somebody really oh knight of pentacles see somebody really wants to work on this partnership but for some reason one of you uh, is making a compromise here and 
for a lot of you, both of you, and for some of you, one of you is definitely having some outside influence. Well, let's clarify. Let's clarify, um, Scorpio. Let's use this deck. Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. I'm picking up a lot of uh, instability and insecurity. This person made you feel so, Scorpio, or this was some previous trauma, past trauma you've experienced. We're gonna see what's that, right? This can be some past life trauma, also some some sort of um, some inner child issue, also. We're gonna we're gonna clarify, but I'm picking up some sort of unresolved, you know, in a. In a Let's see. <clears throat> Let's see what is this going of Pentacles reverse. Energy. King of Pentacles upright, okay. Ten of Pentacles. Some serious financial matter is there. Page of Swords, see. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll let you know. One thing. This is a very specific message. I, I had a vision just now. If you're married to this person right if you're married to this person this is your husband scorpio this person is getting influenced by somebody in their family and this is a financial matter for example if you are asking for financial assistance you might be feeling financially insecure or financially dependent right now this person is getting influenced by their family or at least you are thinking that you are being um sidelined by their family or there's a specific female in their family it can be mother-in-law sister-in-law or uh, can be a friend also, you know. But you are very skeptical about the fi finances. Okay, I'm so sorry. King of Wands is there. King of Wands flipped over. I'm going to put that back. I see if it comes back, right? I am feeling that uh, for a lot of you, um, if you're dealing with an outside female, she might be dealing with, uh, she might be in a relationship or there's an ex with whom there is some financial matter going on right for some of you scorpio i'm picking up that you are having some sort of alimony thing or financial matter going on in your uh, past relationship for example if you are divorced or if you're separated by your ex-partner uh, i do see some financial matter going on there right and this is one of the reasons why this person the one you're dealing with right now your current partner uh, this is the reason why they uh, they are uh, having this issue maybe they're not talking to you or there's some communication gap because they are being um, influenced by somebody in their family or in their surroundings right this can be the topic of uh, you know uh, this can be the reason why they this this third person is uh, influencing your person uh, that you are having something going on in your personal life maybe a separation maybe um maybe your current you know for someone very specific now i'm picking up that there is a partner a married partner and somebody you love so this can be a third party situation also oh my god i'm getting mixed messages what is this queen of swords let's see knight of pentacles nine of cups and six of pentacles again cards are repeating can you see that for a lot of you, I see this person is having some financial opportunity coming their way and this is bringing in a lot of financial security in their life. So somebody, again, second thing that, that can be the reason of them getting influenced by their surroundings or a specific person is that they are getting some financial opportunities, which is, but these financial opportunities are making them very happy and they have dependencies. Someone very, very, very specific. Oh my God, I'm getting continuous downloads. I can't speak that fast. Another download is that they have financial dependencies over them. They have to maybe take care of their family or somebody. Maybe they're giving alimony to their ex-wife or some, some sort of financial thing is going on in their life. And they're being brainwashed by somebody that you are, if, you, if they let you enter their life, you are going to bring some burden on them, right? Because you are also having, the, oh my God, this is very specific, okay? Take it take it if it resonates. Otherwise, this is very specific, okay? Let me know in the comment section. I had two or three downloads, see what situation resonated with you. But the downloads are coming so fast, I'm not able to 
speak so fast, you know, and gibberish things are coming out of my mouth. Okay, so uh, the lovers, let's see what is happening. Let's first see uh, what is happening in the inner world. This for of Pentacles for you. Yeah, for a lot of you, you are trying to resist this connection so much, Scorpio. You know from within that this is a divine connection. You have to make a decision about it. You're so attracted, so attached. There's a, this pull is very strong, but you're just trying to uh, push aside this feeling. You're trying to control. Again, look at that Four of Pentacles. You're trying to control your emotions. You're trying to keep your... Um... Oh my God, the downloads are coming so fast. <laughs> okay. Okay. <clears throat> this never happens with me, you know, while I read. Maybe because of a lot of uh, crown chakra and throat chakra work I'm doing. Anyway, so I do see that you're trying to push aside that strong feeling of attraction and love you have for this person. You're trying to control that. What is this nine of cups for this person? Let's see, nine of cups for this person. Four of cups. You make them happy, Scorpio. They are under influence by, you know, of people in their surroundings. But the fact is that you make them happy right um again this is one of the craziest readings i've done because I, okay I, I, messages are coming so fast as if i'm not just connecting to one person out there one scorpio or this is not one scene or one situation there are multiple parallel things going on scorpio uh i'm feeling that maybe i'm connecting to more than two or three scorpios right now and two or three situations are going on together my god but this person is very dissatisfied very upset you make them happy and they want to connect with you but again because you are not expressing so they're also holding back there is some sort of uh, i won't call it ego as such but yes there's some sort of um, non-expression here and they're very confused how to work on this you know they're mesmerized they're confused they're overwhelmed they do want to connect but again it's becoming it's becoming very hard so I see you stepping towards decisions, but let's see. Let's first see what is the Six of Pentacles for this person. Eventually, they want to come in and invest. And uh, they have a lot of responsibilities, yes. Six of Swords. Again, the card of responsibilities. You know, giving, kindness, responsibilities, High Priestess, and Knight of Cups. Okay, intuitively, they feel that you will talk to them eventually. Or intuitively, they, they know that they need to come forward and offer you what they have for you right they, they have to come and express but they are waiting for the right time because they want to move away from some sort of heavy duties they're going through right now they have some serious responsibilities for someone very specific i just felt that they're rising they're growing financially or they are having some financial opportunities coming their way and they have some things in their personal life some unresolved things surrounding that so they are trying to move forward from that and eventually they might decide to come forward and talk about it but the thing is that your life is changing for someone very specific scorpio i just felt that oh i just felt that uh, you're coming out of cold right so at in past if you were feeling that you know left out and something like that you're coming out of that emotion you're dealing with it or you're simply just suppressing that feeling i just felt you're suppressing your feelings for this person somehow and love is showing me that you have the opportunity so you might feel at the moment you might be like okay let me compromise with this new opportunity new person or for someone specific i just felt that uh, there's a potential partner coming towards you and you might end up deciding you're getting my point something like that knight of wands and queen of see i told you king of wands flipped over earlier remember it's here again so yes there is a third person coming in and two of swords you might be in the position to decide or you might not be in the position to decide because of the confusion but you will have to eventually right so wow king of wands is here scorpio this king of wands is here and this person is uh, very attracted to you it might be very romantic flurry energy sweeping sweeping you off your ground and uh, bringing you the fire and passion of course i don't see something very um committed from their end 
but you have this person gain my point let let's see okay this is for scorpio let's see where is the situation heading scorpio and then we will have couple of advices where is the situation heading for scorpio possible potential outcome between you and this person scorpio potential outcome between you and this person let's see king of pentacles again there are two people give me an earth sign and fire sign you're dealing with right an earth sign and a fire sign you're dealing with here abundance i see the people you're dealing with they are financially stable or very grounded trying to act mature too but then again see wait for the tower moment there's a breakthrough happening here so wait for the tower moment there is something about to happen and that will be giving you oh look at the empress energy sorry seven of pentacles energy i'm sorry that is that patience energy right that that energy of calm so you're waiting for someone i just felt that moon cycle so just wait for the new moon <laughs> something will be starting from the new moon right okay some breakthrough is going to be happening for some of you full moon for some of you new moon right moon cycles are associated here okay scorpio so a breakthrough will be there right and trust i do see the apology as well as the this is my apology card this is the offer card so there will be two proposals right one is a compromise and another is somebody important connection and there are past unresolved issues right so you see how you are going to deal with the situation scorpio right let's get a card of advice for you scorpio sun moon rising venus and jupiter let's get a card of advice for you scorpio sun moon rising venus and jupiter advices for scorpio no scorpio something is a no abundance yes see abundance abundance then knight of pentacles king of pentacles for a lot of you one of the persons you might end up the one you might end up with is of course financially abundant and very secure person this person is going to bring in financial and emotional security towards you as well but for some reason i'm picking up that you have to decide between two people right and one is a big no yes one is a no <laughs> let's see this is for scorpio sun moon rising moon sun jupiter scorpio wow scorpio sun moon rising moon sun jupiter this is for scorpio sun moon rising venus and jupiter for scorpio inner power this is the strength card can you see this leo energy here give me the courage and the power to do what must be done so some decision is going to be difficult honestly scorpio some decision is going to be difficult right but the thing is that uh, you it has to be done so you might be asking you know you might have to turn somebody down or you might have to say no to somebody but you need a lot of power and courage to do that because for some reason you have some deep attraction or deep desire for something right and we have guidance very beautiful look at the star here can you see that so we have when you make divine intelligence your foundation you finally have a fixed star to follow and this is what i feel once you just accept that this is my calling i have to go in this direction maybe the other option is very lucrative and you want to explore it but somehow you're just uh, you don't you know you're asking for courage to follow the right path the other path is very attractive but it is not good for you in the long run you're coming up to make this decision right oh my god Whew. okay so call call for your spirit guides call your spirit guides call for guidance and I see eventually you're finding the right path, Scorpio. Well, so I'm going to leave you here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.